I mean, you gotta. I mean, it's okay. You got a bit coming up too. I'm in there. Bi U T sixty one hundred one point one FM. The franchise is born. The fact franchise here. Sasha Romeo hot and the right in the building. And finally, finally, after being here for a year mm. and watching forty five interviews. And finally pulling me to the side and saying, he didn't even pull me to the side. He just yelled at me. Like, hey, you know yeah, what? I had to, yeah, I had to get it in. Everybody you brought here, I work with them. Right. Ladies and gentlemen, the one, the only, Amon Kush Cafe is here in the building today. <laughs> so I can finally ask you, what do you do to make money? Because not we're here. What oh, do you God. do to make money? Damn, I do a lot of <laughs> shit. Bro. So let's talk about it. What do you do to make money? <sighs> so... I don't even know where you want me to go. Where, You'll be surprised. Start where you want. Right, <laughs> start so, where you want. I am a licensed federal drone pilot. I do commercial uh, site surveys and inspections and surveillance and stuff like What's that. What's a drone pilot? A drone pilot. A drone pilot. Like, like, only like 10, I think, right? Yeah. Wait, I mean, wait, wait, we what, do, what, what is it, though? We we surveil different areas. We do like surveillance like, on different with areas. With a drone? Yes. We do, we do. We do. Spy. We do. We do 3D mapping to create to create different things and stuff like that. To create snitch. whether they're gonna build something, they can't tell how how big the land is. They can do a lot of a lot of different math or out of the sky. So what you it's do is easier. like, you know what? We want to build something right here. What's the width of it? And then you control the drone. I can drone go up there and the I'm, drone okay, will do a okay, 3D map okay, and it'll okay, tell them okay. everything they need to know. And they could do like uh, solar farms and stuff like that. I thought you was champion. So I, yeah, I but I also do it. I also do it for like events and stuff like that. You know, I've been doing it for a while. Fire, fire, so, fire. You know, let's let's I, talk about the bud game because that's why you're here. Let's you talk know. about the bud game. Right? You know. Let's talk about the weed game, the Some drinks, right the edibles, the cookies. Let's get into that, cause that every time I have a guest that does that, you're like, you know what? They work for me. So let's talk. Let's talk about that. Not that they work for me. Either I work with them, <laughs> or we have done something together, or I just feel as though the information might not be 100 percent standard. So let's so, talk about yours. Yeah. Put yours out there right now. What is it that you do in that in that area? I have a master's certification in cannabis. And I have 10 different certifications and in, in 10 different aspects of cannabis, whether it's whether it's the extractions, whether it's the uh, medical aspect of it and things like that. I've, you know, studied a lot of different. So you went to school for it. Right. Wow. So, you know, I, I studied the plant. It's about the plant and the plant does more than just get people high. It's not about getting you high. It does a lot of other things, too. It helps. With, it helps with a lot of other things. So, you know, it's it, it that's what it's about, and it's the love of the plant, and that's what I support. Do you grow yourself? No, I don't. No, don't. And everybody asks me that. Why not? Like, How come you don't grow? Yeah, why don't you grow? I mean, it's I, I did it back in the day. Electricity it's a lot bill? of work. Electricity yeah, all expensive. that. All, all that's expensive. a factor. <laughs> all that's a factor. And now you would have to do it on a big scale, and it's like all this other stuff. But I, I did that. I dabbled in that when I first started, you know? So it's past that now. Like, it's more of the... Of, inside the plant the the other things that the plant does so how'd you how'd you get into edibles and drinks oh man i mean i have a degree in culinary arts also so, so I, you can cook i can cook i've oh. been I, i'm, a, cer I'm a, a certified wok chef a rare state. black man people yeah, this is a rare black york. man yeah i've been in the state of new york i i did a pf changs i opened up a pf changs in syracuse new york i was a certified wok chef i was one of the first 10 in the state to get certified as a wok chef. Um, I worked at Mohegan Sun as a, as a main kitchen head chef. Uh, I've been all over the place. Cellos, I mean, I, all through the all through the culinary industry, all over the place. So that, that helps wow. me out as far <laughs> as the edibles go. Now I know how, once I learned about what I can infuse and infusions and things like that, I mean, now it's limitless because I, I can cook already. So yeah, I know you how. But you I don't know. want to grow, though. So I mean, I don't need to grow. What oh, do I need no, to grow it's for? Not to grow. What do I, I mean, need but to you, grow but for? But you, but you got the drinks, though. You got the drinks. You got the edibles. Right. Um. Yeah, 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 pothead. So asking yeah. you, what do you prefer, edibles or the bud? Bud. The bud. Yeah. Bud all Absolutely. Day. Yeah. Oh, leaf smoker, vapor smoker. No leaves. Uh... Don't say no leaves, but you do games. Don't say that because. I have a button for that, so. Oh, yeah, do it. Oh, okay, here it is. There it is. Give me a second. There it That's is. That's one of them. So you do games, but you don't do leaves. 
Listen, I'm trying to get out. I'm trying to transition out of all that and just go right to the paper because um, I don't smoke cigarettes and and when you're doing the leaves or whatever it is, game or whatever, that's tobacco anyway. So I'm trying to defeat my own purpose. Don't don't judge me, but can you just hear me out for a second? Yeah. Every once in a while, to me, a paper's kind of nasty. Baby. It it's, is. It's, it's, it's and I have nasty, to go, baby. once in a blue moon, I it's do have to, nasty, I do have to go back and start smoking. I, I smoke a game or a blunt. Or I sound like nuts, that. but every once so, in a while, I, to me, a, a joint open, sometimes it's kind of. It's just, yeah, I don't know what it is either. It just it just gets stale for a second, and you're like, oh, I need, I need something different. Like, it's, I think it's tobacco calling you back. Mm. I mean, you get high, but it's just like, if it, it goes out. You gotta keep lighting it, and it's. I don't know. I, Look, like I don't. I don't know. I don't know, B. Shots of vegetarians, and what y'all do too, because I don't. Yeah. I, don't I don't get it. I don't, I need my I don't get it. I took my lighter. I don't God get damn it. it. I don't get it. Um. All right. But what about the drinks, though? How'd you come across the drinks? Making the drinks. Uh, I I I changed up on the drinks like a couple of times when I first um started making them. I was using a um kind of like a G14 classified recipe, <laughs> but... Uh, you all right over there? You good? All right. It, <laughs> it's, it's, yeah, it's um, powdered THC, and a lot of people powdered don't Powdered THC? Yes, there's a way to make... Oh, wait, 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 yes, where we at? No, 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 listen, I gotta, no. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, no, wait, you would wait, never wait, know. Wait, hold on, I got a button for that, too. Wait, what is powdered THC? Because I, I want to know what this is. You can't... It's powdered THC. Now, if you want to know all about that, then we can gonna go into... Um, classes that I'm about to start and I have a curriculum that I'll be able to teach you how to do those type of things but you're going to have to pay because I'm just real quick, I mean I, I, I went to school quick, for this real, real so quick, you're not going to learn what I know <laughs> for <quick>. free <laughs> but real quick just a quick description what's powdered THC though Like it's a powdered THC that you would be able to it, it dissipates in um, any type of liquid you put it in there it just dissipates it disappears and it will have the THC in the, in the liquid you can also use it in any type of foods or whatever you could just sprinkle it on there yeah. and it 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 it's gonna get you high, and but you know, it's hard to it. It's a hard ingredient to find out to correctly make. I'll put it that way. Because you'll hear different things, and they might they're not gonna work out mm. if you try to do it yourself. Now, do you cook your own products? Ooh, yes, I, absolutely. Ooh, we sound like drug dealers, right? Do you cook them? <laughs> do, 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 do you make your own? <laughs> Do you do your own cookies, brownies? Everything, you know, everything, everything. Has there has ever been a, has ever been a time where I need one of each? A time where you didn't put enough, and a time where you put too much. No. <laughs> um, nobody's perfect. Nobody's perfect. They, no. They, they, one of the I other, mean, nobody's perfect. Nobody's perfect. It. That's not. That's not my fault. It's the person who bought it. Fam, stop. Because I'm. I do, when I if I if you're buying something off me, I'm telling you exactly what you're getting into right away. The potency of it, um, what it's gonna do to you, how much I think but I those, recommend those, you should those, eat. Those first couple of uh, batches when you first started, you never accidentally, you know, heavy handed once in once in a while. No, because I'm a chef, so I know how to do measurements measure, on everything. Measure. You damn subway cooker, because they, they count the slices of meat. You ever go to subway and see them count the slices of meat? They go, yeah, yeah, it's six, family. All right, it's six. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> What's the goals coming up? What's the plan coming up? Oh man, um, somebody recommend I should do a podcast. Um, I also have a um, clothing line that I've been coming up with, as you know. Um, Tippy's Chippies is is the name of um, of any type of infusions that I do. Um, that's that's because that's the way it's gonna make you feel. You're gonna feel tippy and trippy at the same damn time. So. Um, and and just just that clothing line and just trying to work on a whole bunch of stuff like podcasting and everything like that. Um, I do have the 420 Expo coming up. Um, that's later on, like in September. That will be in New Jersey. Um, I will be one of the uh, guest speakers, and this will be my second year in a row that they asked me to come up. Um, we do different topics on cannabis and things like that. Uh, last year they had me with the goat. Um, I actually have an autograph book to my brand, uh, Danny Danko, and um, one of my good friends, Bobby Nuggs. Those guys, you know, they, they're one of the pioneers of this industry. Some of them, there's a lot. Um, but I worked a lot 
with those guys. And, you know, we have a lot of, like, you know, a lot of things coming up and a lot of educational things. Because a lot of people don't know about cannabis and uh, other than, oh, just about getting high. Getting high. But they don't know a lot about the, the helps, effects of what yeah, it actually does. Yeah, the effects does. of what it does or what you should use it for. It has different things. It does different things. Different strands do different things. Not just different strands taste good and this, that, Absence. and the other. And they could put you to sleep. But yeah, Sativa I mean, has me running around. Right. But the hybrid, people, I don't yeah, know what I'm going to do people today. that use them. I mean, we can't say exactly what they do. You know, I'm not a doctor. I'll put it that way. But um, they do help you with a lot of things. Um, ailments, uh, pains, uh, you know, this, it's just it's limitless. So the testing, um, they're actually scheduling it right now. The DEA is about to downgrade it. And they're working on that. I just read an article today. Um, they're, they're actually, it's on the table right now. So it's going to be happening soon. Um, they're going to bring that down. Yeah, they're going to bring that down. And that that's big. That's big. The government's bringing it down. Um, take it out of the opioid ca- category and things like that. Um, so, yeah, there's a lot going on. Yeah, all that. Yeah, there's a lot going on, man. It, that's a medicine, man. And, and it, it's, it's. Like I said, it's about the plant. It's the love of the plant, and that's what I represent. So, you know, respect everything it. I do, yeah. Respect it, respect it. Yeah. Family, Um, this is also a hip-hop show, so I have to ask you the question. Oh, on behalf shit. of Leticia, on behalf of Leticia, I need to know who your top five rappers are of all time uh, when you get high. I can't do that. Yes, you can. No. When you get high, who do you listen to? Just give me five. Oh, man, no. It's not a hard five question. Rappers. I don't have a top five. Well, just give me five rappers you listen to when you get high. You see my playlist. The Loonies. I'm all over the, the place. The Loonies. I'm all over the place. Who is that? Who's that? <laughs> I, get, I got five on it. You know who that is. Stop. Oh, stop. Five. You 80, oh, nigga. Man. Stop. No. <laughs> Afro, Afro, oh. Afro, Afro man. man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> give us five, B. Give us five. Oh, man. I see. All right. All right, I'm gonna go here. See, you see, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fuck y'all up. I'm gonna say not not in this order, no, but no just order, just no off order, of, just of fine, lyrical fine, rappers that I like because I'm kind of old school, but I then I'm 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 both ways. I like all music. I like music in general. It's not about what what era you came out or anything, the year or anything like that. Like if you sound good, you got a good beat. Your your rhymes is on point. Stop with the excuses and give no. me five. Uh, Black Thought. Okay. I'm gonna go with Black Thought. I'm gonna go with uh, uh I'm gonna go with oh shit. Yeah, the music is fucking me up too. <laughs> I'm gonna go. See, I like I like beans. Three. I like Nas. Four. I don't agree with your list, but go ahead. No, Three, no, no. Me, I'm all no, over no, the place. No, no, no. Don't take them back. That's fine. Just... That's fine. You can have them. Couple I don't agree with, but go ahead. Give me one more. Vado. <laughs> Vado? I'll give you, I'll, I'll, you know, I'll give you, I'll give you Vado. You hood ass nigga. I'll give, I'll give you Vado, man. You hood ass nigga. I'll give you Vado. You hood ass nigga. Um, out of respect, anything you want to say we didn't get to ask you? Hmm. Yeah. Ask me where I got this sweatsuit from. I'll ask you. Where you get that sweatsuit from? Which one? This one. The one you're wearing, nigga. Like, what, obviously. What, what, <laughs> uh, I got this in South Carolina. I'm trying to support your merch. I thought you made it. My bad. I thought you made the T-shirt. You made the T-shirt? Nope. This is Juice oh, my, I, Yeah, I struck out on both of these. My bad. I struck out on yeah, both I struck out on both of them. Right. Anything you want to say I get to ask you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Yes. You didn't ask me where you could follow me at. Well, that's about, that's my last question. So go ahead. All right, Anything so else. that's what you didn't ask me. Though. Anything you want? The best way to find you? Best way to find me? You can catch me at Ahmad Sullivan on Facebook or Kush Cafe on Facebook or Kush Cafe underscore on Instagram and uh, Threads, Kush Cafe. And now, go ahead and face that camera. Until that Shout love. out to my wife, Tisha. <laughs> you already know I've been on this show a thousand times. Yeah, ain't no doubt, baby. Yeah. <laughs> we already get that out the way. That's, yeah, that's number one. Yes. All righty then. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Came through, informed us. 
and I assume you got you got the best out there. Can I say that? Yeah, the absolutely. Best out there? Yeah. You try it, you're gonna tell me that. Got the best out there. He's put a couple of artists through here to sleep. A few artists came through here. Yeah, you already Adam know. There's a rap. And, and fell asleep here. Yeah, so. they couldn't even do that. Couldn't, couldn't do, do that. Yeah, couldn't yeah. rap. Couldn't, couldn't rap. rap. Couple of times. So yeah. it goes down. It happens. I tried to kick them out a couple of times. Yeah, they, <laughs> they, they banned me like, for nigga, a while. Like, nigga, don't come back. Stop like, bringing these edibles. When I coming here, they said, nah, you, you can't yeah, come back. Yeah, you can't come back. These edibles gotta go. Yeah, they gotta go. Ladies and gentlemen, the one, the only, Amon, representing Kush Cafe here. Appreciate you, family, always.